What is up, Cubes fam? Cubes in a bag with you, and welcome back to Crack in the Crack Pack. Um, sorry for that weird noise. I burped. Oh, come on. Give me a break. I already put it on peaceful. So, um, this is going to be the last episode on this world, but I'm going to do things a little differently. I'm going to take stock of everything we have, and, um, I think I'm going to put together a little starter home or find a starter st uh, a structure to start in for the next world. Um, so basically I goofed and there are too many dimensions in this. Or not dimensions, uh, too many biomes. And I don't really want to relieve, uh, relieve uh, remove the mods, um, but I am going to have to find a couple that need to be removed um, but I don't want to totally lose our progress so I'm going to yikes why am I lagging so much um, let's put that in eight chunks maybe that'll help that helped a little bit um, I know that part of this problem is that I need a new computer um, that's a little more capable. Um, th unfortunately this computer I'm using is a few years old now. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna restart the world sort of. Um, probably pick a less laggy spot because now that I think about it a magical forest has a lot of leaves and so there's constantly leaf updates um, although I probably haven't helped anything by chunk loading a bunch of area uh, but yeah um, so that's what I'm j gonna do is I'm gonna tally up some stuff and I think unfortunately I think because I'm like five or less dimension or not dimension uh, biome IDs short um, I think the the oh, I forgot magnet mode was on um, I think the the mod that's gonna hit the bucket is gonna be Erebus because I want to keep Ars Magica, I want to keep Hardcore Ender Expansion, I want to keep all the Thomcraft add-ons we have. Um, why do I have speed? That's weird. I have infinite speed for one second. Um, I want to keep extra planets as a huge thing because extra planets is where I started running into the problem is because the reason that extra planets biomes are spawning in the overworld is because they're overlapping with a few of the others uh, namely biomes of plenty um, yeah so I uh I want to fix that problem. So either Aether or Erebus is going to go, and I kind of want to keep the Aether. Um, but I feel like we could kind of help ourselves a lot if we just kind of restarted the world. Um, as much as I hate to say it, what is going on? That's so weird. Um, as much as I hate to say it, um, I don't think that this storage system is going to work for us. And that's only because um, I, I like the request system, but there's just too much like live updating going on. I'm also considering um, removing Lycanite's mobs. 
Only because those events can cause a bunch of things to happen, and I don't want to attempt to burn down the forest again. Um, but yeah, so I may record um, making a base in that new one. Um, I got a lot of stuff. Um, I raided a village, I was in a castle thing, I, uh, I was in the Aether for a while, I've got a lot of the Divine Stone, stone stuff. Um, but yeah, I think, I think we're gonna have to go with something like Item Ducts, unfortunately. Um, I'm wondering... If we shouldn't make a beeline in our next world for the uh, applied energistic stuff, and I could actually make use of the the digital chest, because then I can keep things stored in cells. Huh. Um, but another idea is uh, RF tools, modular storage. Um, and I think I'm going to um, take some time off from from doing uh, cracking the crackback because I want to make the recipes more challenging. I want to make some recipes that make a little more sense. Um, I want to universalize some of the recipes. Um, for instance, I want to make it so um, any um, copper can make, say, a copper sword or whatever. Um, actually, I think that is the case, but, uh, I know that there's some mods that are recipe-specific. Whoa, frames, frames, frames! Why is there frame lag so much when I walk toward the farm? Is it because this is broken? Did that fix it? Is it the nether portal doing that? What is up with the frames? Um... I have no idea what's up with the frames right now. Um, but yeah, and and I've also, I think if I have to um, loop on this again, on, on doing Track of the Crackback, I think I might just throw in the bucket for, throw in the bucket, throw in the towel, um, throw the towel into the bucket <laughs> um, for 1.710 and just move on to 1.12 and sort of work from there or just start building my own pack altogether but I want to keep this unfortunately the um the the series the other series I was doing that had the um high vis robocop thing is uh it's not going to be coming back I do have a second episode of it that I may or may not decide to upload but I don't really see the point uh, because all of those worlds are just going to kind of become well I guess that one I hadn't gotten to the Erebus yet so I probably wouldn't lose a whole lot but yeah um, so anyway I'm uh, so as you guys can tell, I'm, I'm not at home, I'm at a hotel, and uh, I'm almost done with my, uh, what do they call it, remedial training. So um, tomorrow I'm back at work properly, so that's a thing. Um, of course this will not be coming out tomorrow, probably. Um, interactions will be coming out tomorrow. Um, yeah, I've been, I've been splicing up the... VOD to put on the channel. And I hope you guys like it. Because I enjoy doing it. Also, there's no point for me to have a world anchor here anymore. And it may be causing some sort of lag just to be a blocked up update being there. Because I'm sure it keeps itself spot loaded, so. But yeah. Um. 
But yeah, I, I, I kind of want to make things a little more challenging with this pack. I don't want to make it an expert pack by any stretch of the imagination, but I want to th make things compatible. I want to make things um, progressive as well. Um, for instance, I would like to make it so that maybe not with the Project Red pipes. Well, we'll see what we'll see what removing a couple mods does. But um, for instance, maybe making the the storage drive recipe require. Why am I seeing stuff? Do I have any bobbles on? All I have is an apprentice ring. Why am I seeing ripples? Um, I also probably lag this world out a little much with the light spell, so I'm not going to be using the light spell anymore um, in the next one. Not, at least not a lot. Um, yeah, I am also kind of starting to be like, you know, 1.12 runs better. As much as I hate abandoning honestly Thomcraft more than anything else because almost everything else stayed the same going forward um, I, I I'm like well maybe it's time and also refined storage is a thing but also I don't want to overshadow Cubescraft so um, which is going to be making a comeback at some point um, it, lately it's just been me on the server so I haven't been wanting to record as much because I've just been doing busy stuff getting the workshop done when I've had time to do it in. Um, which, believe it or not, I didn't end up doing a lot of while I was off on being hurt. Um, yeah. So that is a thing. Sorry I didn't really come up with a, uh, a topic for the day. I'm going to do all the cataloging of everything we have off screen. Um, obviously I'm not going to cheat in the spells. I'll, I'll recreate the spells. Because when you cheat in the spells they're a little broken. Is that what's making me bubble? That must be what's making me bubble. But yeah, I'll... Uh, I'll put in the stuff to make the portals, plus, uh, you know, plus what, whatever we already have, but I'm not going to um, cheat in the portals themselves. Um, but yeah. Um, let's see how long I've been recording. Well, I, I'd hate for this to be a short episode, but really the, the point of making this episode was to tell you guys that... Uh, well, for one, that everything will be repaired. Um, because I'll just add in fully repaired items. Um, it's easier that way. Also, do I have any... I don't have any Tinker stuff right now, do I? Anyway, I'll remake the Tinker stuff, if that's the case. Um, uh, but yeah. Uh, and I'll remake the farm, I'll you know, get the berries. I'm not r removing that Futurum, so... Um, all the fun stuff. But yeah, I uh, just wanted to sort of update you guys with that, and also um, that occasionally, um, for a little while, until I get Crack in the Crack back sorted the way I like it, um, that in my off time of doing something more pointed, I'm probably going to do a little bit of Zen time stuff on my already existing world. Uh, I added uh, augmentations to the Enigmatica non-expert um, mode pack um, just because that's what I've been playing on a lot recently when I've been doing single player stuff that, that wasn't interactions the other day and this. So yeah. Um, and modded DW Insanity probably won't be back until I get a new computer. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep the pack but uh, um, right now I'm trying to fix it because I, I have too many mods in one thing for my computer to like it. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you do, make sure to slap that like button and let me know that you did. Don't forget to support the channel and everything I do over on Patreon, patreon.com slash keepzonelp. Don't forget, keep an eye out on Twitter because I often tweet about if I am or am not streaming. And I've been back to streaming on Twitch a little bit. 
Um, the exception for that being uh, Nightmare in Dreamland and Zelda, I'm going to make sure stay on YouTube. Um, but I've been trying to reach out and stream on Twitch a little bit and then cut up the VODs to put them on YouTube. Uh, but yeah, so I will catch you guys later. Don't let us go. I'll show you out. I'll see you when I see ya. Peace!